Um, you know, when my brother Edward's not here, Edward's not here, we keep up in prayer and know they're, they're working today. I, I do want to thank God. I had acknowledged Kayla in the last couple weeks. I, I'm very grateful that God's blessed us with, a, with some of the things that we handle and they can give us uh, some worship as well. So I'm very thankful that she's here. Uh, when my brother Nick and aren't here, I'm, I'm no longer alone. I've got uh, Kayla here to back me up as well. So praise God. But as I said today, Thank you. 
take maybe what the doctor told you this week and put it right in front of you. Or maybe maybe something that somebody told you about how you're not you're not worth anything or more. Or that they wish they were with somebody else, or that they don't want they don't want to be with you no more. Whatever they, whatever they said.
confused. People don't even know it yet. I believe that they're going to walk home into a miracle in the name of Jesus. And in the best of faith, we say thank you for what you're doing and what you're about to do. Not only in this church, Lord, but in the hearts and in the lives of every man and woman that is represented in this place. Father God, you are mighty and you are worthy. You are worthy. You are the Lamb of God and we worship you. We exalt you. King of glory, King of kings, and Lord of lords. Alpha and Omega, beginning and the end. You're the one. You're the one and only way, Lord. The ball of the Bible calls you the, the way, the truth, and the life, and that's who you are. You're the great I am.
the tithing and the offering, that you would multiply, use it to advance your kingdom, use it the way that you see fit. Teach us and show us to be good stewards with, with what and who you've entrusted us with. Father, I pray in the name of Jesus that you would help us to use it. Like I always say, to empty out hell and to fill up heaven. Use it, Lord, to advance the kingdom of heaven and to attack the gates of hell. I pray that in Jesus' name. And I pray that your will would be done in each and every one of our lives. And that you would tra transform and change our will to your will. That it would not be the other way around. No matter how hard or difficult it may be. Lord, I pray in the name of Jesus that each and every one of us would change into that person that you called us to be. That we would understand that it's never too late to change. And that you love us beyond measure. The overwhelming, reckless love of God. We love you and worship you in Jesus' name. And all of God's people say, Amen. Amen. Would you greet each other in the name of the Lord? And as you do so, you feel free to come up and leave your tithing and offering, please. Thank you. There is joy in the house of the Lord. There is joy. 